Welcome again, YouTubers, to another Game of Thrones unboxing video. Today, we're going to be opening up something that I have wanted for quite a while, and hopefully you all will think it's pretty cool. This was more so, I was just perusing around on eBay, and I found a really cheap price on an item that I thought I needed, I needed, I needed as a part of my collection. So, let's crack this baby open and take a look at what eBay has brought us. I wonder what's inside. I wonder. Oh my! It says Game of Thrones collectible armor. I wonder what it is. I just gotta do this. Yeah! <laughs> All right, I'm gonna spoil it. We got here, the Hound's Helmet. Look at this, this is the outside casing of it. Already looks stupendous and beautiful. We have taped on the side here. Oh, it's another little Nella envelope. Maybe they gave us a raven. No. We got here. This is a official certificate of authenticity that states that this is a, a signature piece from Valyrian Steel, which is the company that makes it. Sold by HBO. It is authentic hound helmet. Really awesome. It's number 1930 of 2500. This here, we got it open finally. This is the beautiful Hound Helmet. First, I'm gonna take this out. This is the stand. This is a solid piece of wood. Also got a little puck thing up here. This is like, uh, it connects like that down below. So move that stand out of the way. There's some screws in here so we can screw it together, thankfully. And this is the base of the stand. Look at this. You, this is how you know it's been used already, but this is a House Clegane base. These dogs were important, and the reason why they're the sigil of House Clegane is there was a Clegane walking by with three dogs, and they helped fight off a lion that was attacking one of the Lannister lords. And that's how the Clegane's got their lordship, so that's why these three ended up being the sigil, and it's really cool to have these on the base of the Hound Helmet. All right, now the beauty. This is what it's about right here. Oh, it's wrapped beautifully. Note that this item's actually been used. I bought this at a very cheap price on eBay, but everything, you couldn't tell that it, that it was. Oh, look at this. Oh, we have the massive honking helmet of the hound. Look at this, he's got little toilet paper rolls in his teeth, basically. But this right here, is the beautiful dog helmet of House Clegane. It's the hound. Ugh. All right, let's take a second to remove these. This thing definitely, this thing weighs a good 15 to 20 pounds. It's like crazy. Me leaning over right now like this is actually hurting my back. Oh my god, it's just so cool. <laughs> How crazy. You can see on the inside, all these things have straps, and this leather strap is attaching all these individual metal plates, which is so cool. And as you can see, remember, this is a helmet meant for fighting. The jaw actually lifts up, just like on the TV show. And I'm gonna show you that in a second, when I put it on. But it definitely has some good maneuverability. There's some good padding on the inside. It's a little tough to see, but right in here is all padded. You can even see that it's individually numbered. Yes, I did. I got this part screwed together, but I did just dent my plate a little bit, but that's okay. 
I'll live with that knowing it was my fault. <laughs> and this is really easy to put together, thankfully. All right, so we've got the stand built. Easy peasy, just like that. Sitting on the stand. Oh, look at that. That thing just screams sex right there. It's so beautiful. Put my hand in his mouth. Yes. Put it on the stand, just chills. Nice and soft. Of course, you can adjust it however you want, but thank God, because this thing is heavy, so it's hard to do the video like this. But finally, the thing you are waiting for, which I hope you were because I was waiting for it, is I have the Hound's helmet here, and I'm gonna stick it on. Ugh, take my glasses off, because the Hound never had no glasses. All right. Oh yeah. Got this right in there. Probably adjust the chin strap. Either that or my head is really big. I can't tell. All right. Just got the hound's helmet fully on. Ah! <laughs> hey, how you doing, everybody? How's it going out there in Bat Productions land? Oh, kind of figuring that part out. Maybe I'll put some comfort in there. I mean, I don't plan on wearing this around the house all the time, but rah, rah. there's supposed to be a thing. There's supposed to be a screw that you can put in that'll keep the jaws open if you want. But for now, pretty awesome. It is stupidly heavy though, because the thing wants to go forward every time I move my head forward. It's like crazy. But, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> this is awesome. <sighs> All right. It truly is hard being the hound, so I'm going to put this down for a second back on its little holder here. Uh, ow, my finger's caught in it. <laughs> but that's it for the video. Um, thanks so much for watching. Um, I know this is ridiculous, but this is an item that I never thought I'd get. And I'll be upfront with you, this item retails for like 300 bucks on HBO's website or Valyrian Steel. And I got it for about 120. Um, it's pretty much brand new. There's basically no problems with it. There's like a slight abrasion on it, but it's really not that big of a deal. I can barely tell. For $170 off, excellent deal. Um, yeah, that's it. So I wanted to share this with you because I figured you all would get a kick out of seeing a hound helmet and I love the hound I named my car the hound so it's pretty cool to have this uh, in addition it'll probably be in the background of most of my videos now so um, nice little kick <laughs> but that's gonna do it for the video thank you so much for watching as always of course check out my other videos I have tons of stuff Game of Thrones Walking Dead all that fun stuff and remember to subscribe as always that's gonna do it thanks so much for watching have an amazing day take care goodbye